The opinion you should follow should be your own. Just consider this video to be a second opinion from a complete stranger online. Consult a financial professional before you invest. Remember to educate yourself first and have the ability to ask the right questions. Hold your financial professional accountable. You and only you are accountable to your wealth and legacy. Welcome to the Wealthy Bucket. In today's session, we're going to discuss options. There's common beliefs behind options. Options are complicated. Options are not complicated at all. Anything that is unfamiliar and that may take a little bit of time and effort to learn may be viewed as complicated. Ask yourself, do you want to learn? Do you want to create wealth in a lasting legacy? The answer should be yes. Creating wealth is not something that happens overnight. It is a process of deliberate action and a lifelong journey. As with all things, if you have zero knowledge and skill, anything is risky. Options, if used properly, are safer than investing in stock. What is a professional? Most financial professionals advise their clients to not engage in options. This is a fact. Professional to us simply means an individual that understands and can act on a specialized skill. So what are options? Investing in options is similar to a stock. Options trade in the exact same manner. There is a bid and an ask price, or there is a buyer and a seller in an auction marketplace. Options can be bought and sold at a fraction of the cost to a traditional stock investment. This is called leverage. Leverage is very good if you have financial literacy. The price of an option is commonly referred to as the premium. If used correctly, options can be used to ensure your portfolio from downtrends and recessions. We will cover this topic in future sessions. Options can generate much needed income. Options perform at a much higher rate than conventional dividends. Ask your financial professional. As stated earlier, there are numerous strategies an investor can create using options that allows for flexibility within the market. Sometimes the investor can be wrong and still make money. Here is a basic table that illustrates what buying and selling an option can offer. The buyer of a call option has the right, but not the obligation, to buy the stock at a predetermined price by a predetermined date. The buyer of a put option has the right, but not the obligation, to sell the stock at a predetermined price by a predetermined date. The seller of a call option has the obligation to sell a stock at a predetermined price in return for the premium received. The seller of a put option has the obligation to buy a stock at a predetermined price in return for the premium received. Basic Option Strategies for this session, we will only be explaining the strategies from a buyer's perspective. We will cover these strategies in future sessions in more detail as a buyer and a seller. Long call or put. Choosing a long call or long put strategy is the same action as investing in a stock or selling the stock short. Remember, short selling is not as risky as people believe. Spreads. Spread strategies allow an investor to make a limited profit in return for less loss. Strangles. Strangles are strategies used by investors when they expect a large movement in any one direction. Straddles. Straddles are used when an investor feels the price of a stock has very limited potential to move in any one direction. Combinations. Combinations allow for an investor to manipulate time 
and mimic stock ownership without owning the stock. The leverage is definitely powerful. Remember, there is a time and a place for each strategy. Take a look at this time and price graph. It is Caterpillar's graph, symbol CAT. We have created an entry, an exit for loss, and an exit for profit. Entry and exit, a trading plan. We will cover trading plan, entry and exit in future sessions. This plan illustrates a precise entry point, and for taking this investment, the investor will be willing to lose $1.11 per share for the opportunity to earn $7.17 per share. Now let's take a look at the same investment from an options perspective. As you can see, the options for CAT trade exactly like a stock. There is a bid and an ask. From these buyers and sellers, the financially literate and skilled investor can go shopping to find the best price that will fit the point of entry on their trading plan. For this particular investment, we use the vertical spread. We chose April 97 and a half calls and April 110 calls for this particular stock for this specific investment strategy. We will cover this in more detail in future sessions. For participating in this investment, the loss is potentially $47 per contract and the gain is potentially $301 per contract. Cost of the option is $4.25 per share or $425 per contract. Instead of trading the stock, it costs $98 per share or $9,800 per 100 shares. Options can be an amazing complement to your investment strategy. It's not hard to learn. Anything worth doing won't be easy. Do you want financial literacy and control of your wealth? We sincerely appreciate you investing your time with Wealthy Bucket. Please follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube.